Hey y'all, it's Prissy, welcome back. I am in the kitchen, I'm making me a little bit of lunch. It is about 12.30 and I haven't eaten and I'm not really hungry right now. I did make an iced coffee to go, but I wanna just drink this down a little bit and I don't wanna eat anything right now. So I'm gonna make my lunch to go. Let me show you what I got. So I got a sub, it's kinda like a BLT, except I have, well I think I wanna cut it like this cause yeah, I'm gonna cut it straight in the middle. So there's the sandwich. We have some mustard and mayo. We got a little bit of Kobe Jack cheese, some spinach, some lettuce. And I dressed the lettuce with a little bit of red wine vinegar and this submarine oil. I chopped it up kind of fine, put it in a bowl, let that sit for a little bit, and then I put it on my sub. I also have some jalapeno peppers, some red onion, tomatoes, some pepperoni, and some bacon. So that is my lunch. Hopefully it can fit in this little container right here. No, I think I need one bigger. So I'm just gonna pop it in my little glass dish. Just like that, I'm gonna go grab the lid for it. And then I also have some chips. I couldn't decide. Well, I always love the classic Lay's and Dorito combo. I love eating that. But I had some flaming Hot Lay's and I just got all three today. I got me some pickled jalapeno peppers. And then for my dessert, I got a brownie with nuts. So yeah, that is my little lunch situation. The only thing I'm missing, y'all, is pickles. I love pickles, so I might stop and get me some pickles, like, for real, for real. But yeah, let me clean up this little mess I made with the cutting board and the knife and all that stuff. And then I, oh, I'm telling y'all what, what I'm packing, but I didn't tell y'all where we're going. We're going to the thrift store. I'm gonna stop by, well, not stop by, I'm gonna go to the Salvation Army because I haven't been to this one in a while. And the last time I went, I found a few, you know, a few good things. So I'm gonna go back to the Salvation Army and bring you guys along with me. So let me pack up my lunch. This is my little bag I'm gonna put it in and it has that refrigerated type thing, cooler bag type thing on the inside. So I'm gonna keep my lunch good and secure in there. The weather is like in the 60s, so it's not hot outside today. So it should be fine sitting in the car while I'm in the store thrifting. And I need to get some Clorox wipes with my hand. Let me go grab those and then pack my lunch and we'll head out to the thrift store. Trees are in green, the ocean is gray, sky is a vague blue, come away. My room is a mess, it could use a hand My favorite TV shows to capture in I know my get a ride Must get back in the fight This can't be a surprise I think I'll let it slide We made it to Salvation Army. This isn't the Salvation Army that I was gonna go to, but the other one is a little bit farther away and I knew on the way back, I was gonna have to deal with a lot of traffic. So I decided to come to this one. I'm gonna start in the clothing section just a little bit. Y'all know I'm looking for home decor mainly, but I am gonna just peep around, see if there's anything that kind of jumps out at me. Purses are first. These are J. Crew. I like these. Oh, six. Why they couldn't be a little bit bigger? And they're tall. And then look at this pair, y'all. These are Zara, $6.99. These were $6.99, but they're blue tags, so they're half off. You don't care what you're doing to me. I've been down in the ruins so deep. All the games they play, all the love you're forsaken, you let it slip away. 
way. Oh, 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 oh. you don't care what you're doing to me. Every setback, every mishap, every time you say you gon' change. Say you get it, you regret it, I forgive it, but you stay the same. You should go. Look at this sweater dress, y'all. I kind of want it. <laughs> Let's see the price on it. It is $4.99, which is a pretty good price for it. This is a jacket. Oh, yeah, this is a was like a trench. I don't see anything. I think I'm going to run through the men's section, and then we're going to head over to home decor because that's where I think I'm going to be lucky at, right over there. Look at those nikes, those are cute. This is the case by the men's section, so I'm just gonna look through it real quick. This is where they normally keep more of the, you know, nicer shoes. Ooh, the vest, y'all. This one feels a little too dressy, though. Feels stiff. Oh, bummer. I like that. That's $8.99, it's blue tag, which is half off. Ooh. Oh, look at that velvet. Ooh, that's nice. It's $6.99. It's just a whole tux. That's good. $25. Bucks. Look like it's a whole suit, cummerbund, everything. Ooh. These are a pair of Tommy Relax Fit. Oh, size 34. I could do those. They'll be a little baggy, but y'all know I like them a little baggy. I don't love them. Y'all, look at these set of nesting tables. These are so nice. They're $59.99 with 10% off. Ooh, and they're heavy. It must be, I don't know. They're heavy. These would be cute for a patio. I don't know why they got this music up so loud today. It don't normally be this loud. We're about to head over to home decor. What's this? Mm, I don't know. This looks like an older bowl. It's $2.99. I like the outside of this cup. I don't like the inside. I do like the outside though. It's $1.99. This is $2.99. It's $3 at Target, brand new. So, <laughs> I don't know about that. Are these plates? These are Ikea. I don't know what they are though. Probably could put candles in here. You could probably use it as a coaster. I don't know what that is. Oh my God, look at these plates, y'all. How cute. These are $2.99. They also have the regular little saucers to go with them, $1.99. And then the small saucers, 99 cents. This is $3.99. This would be good to put my utensils in. I may want to switch out one of them that I have at home. I'm going to put this in my cart. Look at these plates, y'all. They're like glass, ceramic. They are $2.99 a piece. Look at that pretty design on them. They have the smaller ones, but the smaller ones have like a different type of embossed pattern on it look at that how cute and fun are those the small ones are $1.99 the large one is $2.99 and they have a set of four of the large a set of five of the small
how beautiful. It's like glazed pottery. These are $1.99. I doubt I would eat off these, but they are beautiful. Look at this, y'all. Is this a cookie jar? It's $14.99. Shaped like a like a fishing bag. That's cute. And then here's another one. Whoever donated these were like fan of going fishing. This one is $14.99 as well. That's what the inside looks like. So I found these. I think I'm going to get them. They are just so cute for a nice dessert, right? Some ice cream. Oh, this might be my new ice cream bowl. But there's only really a set of two because two of them are broken. There's four in total. They're 99 cents each, y'all, which is a great price. How cute. These are the other two. Look, let me show you one of them. See, that one's broken. I came in the fitting room real quick, y'all. I'm about to try these on. This is all I'm gonna end up getting, y'all. These two pretty glasses. I ain't mad at it, cause they pretty. And I wish I could have gotten all four, but I'll settle for these two. You have a great afternoon. You Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right, y'all, we have left the Salvation Army. Now I'm at a thrift store called Hubbard House. Hubbard House thrift store and I haven't been here in a good while probably like a year or two because they just don't never really have anything especially clothing items they ain't really got nothing in there like that so I barely go in here but since I'm looking for home decor I decided I would stop in here to see what they have and if there's anything that catches my eye so let's head in and see what we can find purple it's half off the boutique tags and it looks like orange too or I don't know I don't know that's a little confusing then they got 30% off furniture then it says see look y'all this is confusing but let's go inside blue purple orange on sale we just walked in at the right time look at this dresser y'all it's pretty it's sold though here goes some magazines, y'all, and I've been looking for some. I wonder how much these are. So I'm walking through the furniture section first. They got a lot of furniture in here. It's all over there. I got a lamp like this, and I love it. Mine is black, though. But I've had that for so long. I bought it on Facebook Marketplace. It looks just like this. They want $80 for this one. Oh, they finna get this vanity right here, y'all, with the mirror. It's look like it's so pretty. What are they doing? Why do you think you finished looking at the furniture back here I want to show y'all that three-piece set but somebody's standing in front of it like they're gonna purchase it and so I don't want to get all in front of them but look at this headboard it's dirty though but I like that it has the shelves right there this headboard is $80 pepper shakers like this look 
it goes with this set right here. Oh, they got the um the inserts to make the table even longer than this. It's two inserts to go to this table. That's crazy. Like your house gotta be huge for this. They got more books back here, but I don't know if they have any magazines. And now here's the home decor slash housewares. They have this area right here, so we're gonna go through it and hopefully find something. What's these black things? Oh, I don't know what that is. That looks like some tires or something, I don't know. Look at this acrylic tissue box. It's white on the inside. I like that. It's three dollars. Look at all this stuff we're about to get into, y'all. Ooh, these are heavy. They're three dollars each. These look like all sets, which I would love to have something like this, but I don't want to have to buy the entire set in order to get that. They have two of those. I would love both of those. But I'm not buying the entire set because I don't need that. Like this one, entire set, $200. I'm not seeing anything. Are y'all seeing anything that we just like gotta take home? Cause I don't. chance at finding something if I don't find anything over here I'm more than likely not gonna find anything Ooh, an expandable trivet That's what it looks like. It's kind of rusty. to Marshalls and I grabbed a couple things out of there then I met up with babe we ran a couple errands and then went to Aldi and I went in there for one specific thing so I'll show you everything I got in today's video y'all know the only thing that I really picked up was those glasses this is so pretty how pretty is that y'all I'm so happy to have these. I would have been even happier if all four of them would have been in great condition like these. Now I wanna say Salvation Army has either 40 or 50% off their home decor or either the entire store on Wednesdays. That's when I need to start going. So I may go to that other Salvation Army that I was telling y'all about. I may go there next Wednesday, but I'm gonna find out for sure what day the sale is on. And actually I'm just gonna put it right here and then y'all know we went to the Hubbard house 
The only thing I got out of there were magazines. I spent $2.15 on all of these magazines. I've been telling Babe that I want to do a vision board. And so that is what I got all of these magazines for. We are also going to take a trip to the dollar store, get some foam boards or whatever we decide we want to do our vision board on and the glue, all that stuff. We're going to go and pick all that stuff out and work on the vision board. Most of them are L Magazine, and I got two of this Gulf Shore Life. Got some really good like photos and stuff in there. This is L. Got one Vanity Fair, and then the rest are L. I had to go wash my hands, get that thrifted stuff off my hands, cause I also went to Marshalls and Aldi, so let me show y'all what I got. So I don't know if y'all remember when I picked up those oven mitts from Marshalls and then realized they look kinda like denim. I went to take those back today and they still didn't have anything except those short mittens and babe don't like them. So I am gonna go somewhere else, maybe Ross again another day and see if I can find something. But in the meantime, I went ahead and just exchanged those mittens and got some strainers some black ones i got these to go with my other black ones and these are mainly for cooking videos because we have a set of like stainless steel ones at home so when i'm doing my videos this will look a lot better in them so i went ahead and picked these up they were only 5.99 and then my can opener. I was using it the other day and I noticed how rusty it was. And I was like, oh my God, I don't use a can opener that often cause I don't use anything in a can too much. So I didn't know it was like that rusty, but it was disgusting. So I told him just throw that away and I'm gonna go find another one. I picked this one up, it's by the brand Brawlo. It was also $5.99. I think the issue is that we be putting it in a dishwasher and I told babe, I don't think we need to do that. Like, just, let's just give it a light little wash because I don't really use it on too many canned goods. So I think it'll be good. That is it from Marshall's and let me show you what I picked up at Aldi. I went to Aldi specifically for this bowl. I saw it in one of their ads last week and then I actually saw it in person the other day when I was in Aldi but I didn't pick it up. It was $15 and I felt like I would find it in Marshalls or either Ross for maybe like 10. So I was like, I'm gonna wait on that. But when I went into Marshalls tonight, I saw a smaller one, like half the size of this and it was $12.99. So I'm like, you know what? Let me run back to Aldi and get that one. So that is what I did. It's just a natural wood bowl. And I plan on making my like sandwich breads and learning how to make sourdough bread and making it in this bowl. I feel like I'm gonna have to season it, you know, like add a little bit of oil to it. So if you guys have any recommendations on what type of oil I should add to this bowl, please let me know. All right guys, so that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed all of the thrift shopping we did. If you enjoyed the video, please be sure to give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and turn on your notification bell so you never miss an upload. And as always, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.